What's up everyone? It's Game Maniac here. <clears throat> here for another little quick little video here. Uh, just wanted to talk about Toonami on, uh, that aired on April Fools <laughs> uh, this past Saturday night. Um, where they put, uh, you know, it was crazy. <laughs> um, I, had, I mean, I'm pretty sure nobody had any indication that it was going to do that. Um, <clears throat> especially I didn't. Um, but you know, I actually caught it by, uh, cause I, I usually watch Bleach every Saturday. That's usually the only thing I really watch on Adult Swim much anymore. Um, but, uh, I actually missed Bleach this week, um, <laughs> cause I was uh, hanging out with, uh, my cousin and, uh, some friends and stuff. So <clears throat> I, uh, missed Bleach, but I, uh, turned it on, uh, for whatever reason, I for I usually don't, but I just I turned it on just to see for what just see what Full Metal was doing and uh, Dragon Ball Z was on and I was like, what is this? And then uh, I was like, oh, so uh, April Fools. Uh, Adult Swim always does something on April Fools, um, <clears throat> but I was like, this is kind of weird. Why is Dragon Ball Z like? I mean, the original, the one that aired on Toonami. Um, <clears throat> at that point, I didn't know it was Toonami. I just thought they were doing a little. Uh, you know, just a change in their programming for the for the day. Um, but then when it, when Dragon Ball Z ended, because that was about in the middle of the episode, it was like I don't know, it was like right when uh, Gohan and Cell were like shooting their uh, Kamehameha blast right at each other <clears throat> is when I went into the episode. Um, so, but th when that ended, and then uh, the little uh, you know the tsunami bump came on uh, with Tom and you know his. Uh, <laughs> saying what's next and everything um, I was like Toonami? You kidding me? <laughs> like uh, it's pretty awesome uh, <clears throat> suffice it to say I did not go to sleep until like 6 a.m. that morning uh, just to, I mean I had to watch it I mean it's been four years since I've seen Toonami so I was definitely gonna stay up and you know watch it so uh, <clears throat> but they had uh, Dragon Ball Z and, uh, well, they started out with Bleach, I guess, and then Dragon Ball Z, and they had, uh, Gundam Wing, which I've never been a big, huge fan of Gundam, but, I mean, you know, it's part of Toonami, um, and then Tenchi, Muyu, and, uh, what else did they have? They had Big O, Yu Yu Hakusho, Trigon, um, what else? They had some other ones, too. Um, later on, they had, like, Astro Boy and Gigantor, which, I mean, those are really old. <clears throat> but I, I thought it was pretty cool um, just to see Toonami again in its, its old form like not the uh, you know it was like Tom 3 I guess his third edition <clears throat> but I was uh, you know for nostalgic reasons it was pretty awesome um, and as far as I know I mean there's a bunch of people that were talking about it um, I, I went on like the Adult Swim forums and stuff and we're just checking out uh, what people were saying about this <clears throat> And uh, it was crazy because, like, you didn't know what was coming up. You had to wait and, like, look at, you know, wait for the commercial bump uh, of Toonami to find out what was going to come up next. So you would know, like, two shows ahead. That was about it. <clears throat> but uh, it was pretty cool and exciting to watch it. Um, whether or not it's going to actually, you know, whether it's a one-night deal or whether it's actually going to come back, you don't, you know, you never know. Um, personally, I, I'd be, I think it would be awesome if it came back, um, like, just take over Adult Swim Saturdays and just have, you know, to, like, Toonami instead. That'd be pretty cool to me. Um, <clears throat> whatever, you know, but if it was a one-time deal, that's awesome, too. Uh, I thought it, thought, thought it was a cool night. Um, but, you know, um, with that being said, um, I've watched quite a few videos now of other people reacting and stuff. Uh, some people were very ecstatic about it. Um, I would be in that category. Um, not ca I'm, I'm also one that I mean I don't care whether, like I said, I don't care whether it comes back, whether it doesn't, does. <clears throat> I think it'd be awesome if it did. But I guess some people were uh, angry about it coming back for some reason, <laughs> which I mean that that's kind of retarded to me. But uh, <laughs> just watch it and enjoy it. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I figured I'd 
want to do a little quick video on it. Um, put my thoughts out there, uh, how I thought thought it was and stuff. Um, <clears throat> it was just great seeing seeing old Toonami back. Um, just cool. Um, <clears throat> I got into Toonami. I didn't start watching Toonami until it was. Uh, <clears throat> It was a little farther in. I didn't start. I know it started in '97, but uh, I actually didn't get to watch it until it was more like uh, towards the towards the end of 2000, I believe. Um, <clears throat> up until that point, I didn't have a Cartoon Network channel. So, but once I did get it, I started immediately watching it because I I knew I would like Dragon Ball Z and uh, and whatnot. That's basically why I went and started watching it. <clears throat> and. Uh, it definitely, for the most part, I'd say, uh, got me into anime in the first place, which is why I watch so many now. Um, but, which is always cool. Um, but, uh, yeah. You know, pretty cool, cool stuff. So, like I said, Toonami hasn't been on since, like, September of 2008, which <clears throat> I actually quit. I, didn't, I never saw the ending of Toonami when it actually ended, because I had stopped watching it by then. Um, I think I stopped watching it, uh, when Naruto got into, uh, you know, the 85 episodes of filler. I, uh, that's when I quit watching it, pretty much, because at that point I'd only, I only watched it for Naruto, and, uh, I was actually watching the One Piece, uh, Funimation dub when it was on there. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, you know, but, uh, that, they ended one piece on there and then uh, all it was was Naruto filler and I just I don't know I didn't like those episodes so I I, I didn't watch them but uh yeah Toonami's uh got a great place in my memory and it was uh like I said awesome to see that uh come back uh just for the one night even uh so yeah with that I'm ending the video just uh nothing too much else but uh oh Maybe if Toonami did come back, <clears throat> I was thinking of some shows maybe that would maybe possibly be able to be put on it, um, new shows and whatnot, especially if they, they ended up not being later, like if they were earlier still, um, but I was thinking like maybe <clears throat> Fairy Tale would probably be a good one, Toriko, um, and I would, I would say bring back One Piece on there, um, give it another shot, and then... Uh, I don't know, I'm sure there's other ones, but those are some of the ones I was thinking. And then I would think they should definitely p keep a, a spot open for like a classic anime little part too, to where they always play played a classic uh, anime as well. Um, I just think that would be pretty cool. But uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? You think uh, would rather you'd want Toonami to come back or not come back? You know, uh, and if it did. What would you want to even see on it, or uh, would you only want to see the older shows for nostalgic reasons? But I mean, nostalgia only lasts for so long. You gotta have something new to keep it going. So you know, what would you want to see on it if it did come back? Um, obviously, you would want awesome, cool tsunami bumps because I mean that's the whole you know the feel of tsunami is the, those bumps. So um, yeah. With that, I'll end the video, and I will see everyone later. This is Game Maniac. See ya.